Hello, guys. Good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening. Do you hear me? Yes. Good evening, teacher. Classmates. Classmates. Jenny says, good evening. Do you hear me well? Is my sound yes. fine? Okay, great. Great. Okay, uh, guys. Uh, first of all, I want to apologize with you. I would be using only the microphone because I am a little bit sick and my appearance, my personal appearance, I don't want to scare you if you see me, okay, to be honest. Um, no problem. Teacher. That's why I'm going to be using only the microphone. I hope tomorrow I can be better than today. All right. It would be just uh, this class, I hope. All right. And you? I hope that you are better than me in this moment. Tell me. Good day. Yes. Good day. Normal day. Normal day. Yes. Yes. Okay. We got a virus everywhere that is affecting a lot of people, right? Were you sick? Exactly. Were you sick any any day ago? No? Yeah, the last weekend I, I was sick. Ah, oh, last weekend you were. Okay. Yeah. But now you are recovered, right? No, I, yeah, I better. I'm okay. better. I'm, yes, I'm, I'm, yes, I'm, I'm pronunciation I'm is better. I'm, yeah, the contraction. I'm. Okay, a great to see you. You don't have any problem if you want to have the camera on, that would, would be perfect. Okay, hello everyone. Jenny, Pedro, Portillo, Oscar, Sandra Vasquez, Yancy, Andrea. Welcome, Yancy, Andrea. Melendez, and Yancy, Andrea, Melendez, Mayen. Twice. I see your name twice. Maybe you are connected in two devices, but no problem. Ivan, oh, Garcia. Yeah. Uh, Pablo, okay, no problem with that. Daisy, maybe Lena, Jamie Roosevelt, and Alberto. And Sandra Amelia, welcome everyone, guys. All right, today we have new topics that we are going to practice in this lesson. Did you receive the, the lesson that I sent you in the WhatsApp group a moment ago? Did you receive it? Uh, I did. Yes. Yes. yes, teacher. Yes, we do. Okay. okay, perfect. At the end, you will I, find I, the, the links. Uh, right? Teacher, I didn't. Because I think so, you don't have my WhatsApp. Uh, but uh, in the links that yes. English Corporativo assigned to you, there is a WhatsApp group. I will be sending to you in this moment. Just let me open it. Okay. Because in the case that you are not in the WhatsApp group, we have a link. But I will be sending it in this moment, don't worry, in the chat. Okay. Let's corporative chat. Okay, just give me one moment. Chat, chat, chat. Okay. If you are not in the group, please join. That is the link. Okay. All right, you can wait after class. Now we are gonna uh, study the lesson that we got for today. Okay, let me share my monitor in this moment with you. Okay, Christmas is coming, right? Christmas. Do you like Christmas? Christmas, yes. Do you like yes, Christmas? I like it. Next month. That is yes. the most uh, beautiful the month in during the year, I guess, because people like sharing things and going to places, etc. And cook turkey, of course. Okay, I'm going to open the presentation. Just allow me one moment. Okay, what lesson are we going to cover? Three. Three, lesson three. <laughs> no, lesson three was the last week. Uh, five. Lesson... Lesson... No. Okay. Six, uh, six, six. Yes, the four from four. the previous week. And yesterday, well, that was Monday, with, the, with that one, we got five. And this one, that is tonight, we got six. six yeah. All right, yes, six lessons. Okay, hi, welcome, guys, to this lesson. Okay, the same thing, don't worry about it. 
Okay, and the indications, you know them. We are not going to stop in the indications. And of course, if you have questions, doubts, you can ask. Okay, we can pass that over. And as always, we practice speaking, listening, grammar, and at the end, the practice. All right. Let's see, intermediate model, model one. Okay, the topic that we are going to study is about this, evaluating. Evaluating. With adjectives. With adjectives. All right, with adjectives. How to? How to evaluate something that doesn't qualify for something else. Okay. When you go to a store for a new cell phone, you maybe take some minutes to check the cell phones that are in the store, right? And yeah. you look at some cell phones, you look at Samsung, uh, Huawei. If that object doesn't qualify for you, you just leave it. Okay. And in that case, we can use adjectives to qualify things. Yeah. Okay. The first one that we are going to see is with the use. Use the verb that can be or plural. Singular or plural. Or plural. With with the, the word, word to. Do you mm. remember the meaning of the word to? Demasiado. Ah, okay, correct. In negative, yes. Okay, at your left, uh, we got that picture. What do you think the picture is? It's a building a or apartment. Okay, yeah, those are, oh, okay. Uh, in, those, in singular or plural? Those uh, plural. Apartments. Ah. Yeah. Plural. Those are apartments, correct. Apartment. Okay, uh, as a first option, we have apartments. Apartments um, aren't, aren't big enough for families or fam families let's repeat families families, families. yeah families. we it's true that families. we have a letter a, a but this is okay. grammar pronunciation family. is different yes it's a fam family family correct a. family if you check verb to be in negative big is the yes uh, adjective. Adjective. the adjective. adjective and this is um an adverb to give it a, a, a qualification enough what is enough? Enough. Big enough. Big enough. Okay. Correct. As a second option, the picture. What is a picture below the first one? <clears throat> Apartments are too small for big dogs. Yeah. Okay. Do you have dogs? Do you have any big dog in your house? No, I don't have. You don't. Okay. Any I, of you? I don't. Do you have any Labrador or... A Dalmata, a Dalmatas are, are big, big dogs. Yeah. Or Grandanes. A Rottweiler. Ro ah, Rottweilers are big. Yes, those are big. Okay, and this one, the difference is that the first one is negative and the second one is affirmative, but affirmative. you can use two. Two is small. What is two is small? Too small. It's clear. Too small. I buy that one. Too small. Uh -huh. Two is small. Dogs <laughs> can live in a small apartments. No, it's not recommendable. They need a space, okay, for big dogs. And this is the first one. Look at the sentences. Okay, next. Uh, we have an indication. Make. Make sentences. With correct adjectives or nouns with a picture. Okay, let's repeat nouns. Nouns. Yes, this is a letter O, but that is in grammar. Pronunciation should be nouns. Uh, yeah, teachers. Okay. Yeah. Teacher. The mm -hmm. second word is sentences or sentences. Oh, good. Okay, we got a mistake. Good eye. Great that you told me. Okay, okay. that is how you scan or you can scan what you see. Yeah. Make sentence. Sentence. And we need the letter C. Okay, now it's correct. Thanks. Okay. okay. Uh -huh. In the question, um, we have uh, these ones. Look at them. You can do similar to this one or similar as the second one with uh, the pictures. The first pictures, what do you see? Uh -huh. What is that animal? Um. Yeah. Monkey. Chimpanzees. Chimpanzee. Chimpanzees. Mm, but in English? Monkey. 
No. No. Gorilla. No. Gorilla. No. no. Those are different. Monkey is different. Gorilla is different. And these yeah. are. Simio. Simio. No. Chimps. Chimps. Chimpanzees. That is the normal chimps. word, but we can call it chimps. Okay. Chimps. Yeah. What can you say? What adjective can you give to the chimps? If you are going to compare, and the second picture is, what is the second picture? What is that animal? Oops. Hippopotamo, uh -huh. uh, in English, uh, I don't know. Uh, okay. are small than hippopotamus. Hippos, okay. Hippopotamus is a normal word, but uh, you hippos. can, hippos. yeah, you can say hippos. Okay, but you need to give it an adjective to compare. We are comparing two things. That's why the lesson is about that. Just let me make it smaller. Okay, evaluating with adjectives. Chimps is the subject. <clears throat> Sorry. Okay, look at the, the sentence. This is the subject. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Any idea about the how the sentence can be done? I don't know, chimps are in small animals live in a in, in a two okay. small place. A small no son animales pequeños para vivir in lugares. Okay. okay. Chimps are too chimps are too big. Too, too big are too big. Too big or too small. Don't. Too big, big. but Chim okay. Chimps are too big to live in a house. Uh, okay, the sentence is correct. House. But what is the? Why don't we give it the adjective intelligent? Why don't we use it? Uh, chimps are uh, uh, smart. Uh -huh. are, Look at the first one. Uh, chimps aren't aren't small to small. Okay, Ooh. there you go. Okay. Chimps aren't small. Aren't small. Mm -hmm. Small. Yeah. Aren't, you can give it in, in negative. Chimps aren't yeah. small. Aren't small. Mm -hmm. For. Okay, but you need to use the word enough uh, to make it uh, complete. Okay. Aren't small enough. Uh huh. Enough, enough to, to live in a box to live in a to live in a, uh -huh. in a or an apartment or an apartment okay in a house yeah. etc but chimps or, aren't uh, small enough no. it, it says dice ahí los chimpancés no son lo suficientemente grandes uh -huh. mm -hmm. enough enough, huh? enough. Mm -hmm. What else? Can you complete the sentence? To uh -huh. live to in a house. To live in a house. In a house. Okay. Is the sentence correct, guys? Teams aren't small enough. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's, it's okay. No problem. The sentence has sense. Okay. But don't, don't forget that you can use enough as, okay. a, as a word. Okay, what can you say about the hippos comparing them against the chimps as a second sentence? Can you do a similar sentence like uh, this one? Similar sentence with this, uh, with this structure. The, the, the hippos, the hippos are, are too big. The hippos are too big are too big uh -huh, too big to live in a house to live yes to live in a house okay we have a different sentences similar but yeah. different sentences okay and if you check you can use the verb to be in affirmative or in negative yeah. in plural we have plural but imagine that you have only one chimp <laughs> Imagine you have only one one chimp in the picture. Yeah. Can you make any sentence with in singular with the verb to be? The chimp is uh -huh. not small. The chimp. Uh, okay. Chimp isn't. Isn't. Correct. Uh, okay. Isn't. You gotta use. 
Ajá. You gotta use the verb to be in singular yeah. because the chimp is only one. Ajá. All right. No. Uh, the chimp isn't. It is a chip, teacher. Ah, the chip, chips. Maybe I'm hungry. <laughs> the chimp. Okay, I got the letter M uh, missing. I had it. All right, the chimp. It's small enough. Is enough enough to live. Isn't is small enough. Small enough. Mm -hmm. You can yeah. use the same complement. No, to live no in an apartment. To live in an, an, par an apartment. apartment. All right. Yeah. Okay, there you go. So if you check, we are using two different structures. If you want to compare uh, one object in singular or plural with another object using yeah. this structure. All right. Questions with this one? I don't know. Okay. And what about the rest? I don't listen to you. Okay, let's participate. Hey. Okay, let's see the next one. <clears throat> After this, we are going to check the next one. Those Did are... You? Yes. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I am Josué Cibrián. Uh, okay. I don't... I don't can see... I I can't see. Mm -hmm. I can see the share screen. Ah, really? I, can, I can't. I can't. Okay, okay, I will share the screen one more time. I'm gonna pause it. Ah, uh, no, yeah, now. Okay, now so, can I see English Corporativo? Only okay. this. Okay, let me reopen it. Okay, so what about now? Do you see this? Now, screen? yes, yes, okay. now. Can I? Okay, yeah. okay good. No problem. Okay, we are gonna see the next one. And let me make it bigger. Okay. In next, it says comparisons. Hello, comparisons. Comparisons with adjectives. With adjectives. The previous one was uh, different. The previous one. Evaluating, okay? We yeah. are using this one. But with this one, we are going to compare. We uh -huh. use, we can use it the same, verb to be. In which way? Singular, plural, with the word to. Okay. okay, sentence. Houses aren't Houses as, are in as convenient as, 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 as apartments. apartments. What is the adjective in the sentence? What is the adjective? Convenient. convenient. Yes. Uh, do you agree yeah. with this? Do you agree that houses aren't as convenient as apartments? Do you agree with the sentence? Mm. Yes. Uh, why? Why do you agree? You must have a reason. You must have a reason why you like. Yeah, because okay. Because are... the word describes <laughs> like a, as apartments. Oh, uh, okay. On but the, the question huh? is why houses aren't as convenient as apartments. What are the advantages of apartments instead of houses? It de depends of what do you want. Uh, okay. In other countries, it's very expensive to live in a house. Uh -huh. Correct. Yes. yes. Okay. That's why houses aren't as, as convenient, convenient as, as, as apartments. If you check, we're using two words. We're using as. As. In the middle yes. is the adjective in the middle. And yeah. after the adjective, another uh, as uh, apartment. In that, the, in that way, you compare. What is the meaning of the sentence? Las casas no son tan convenientes como los apartamentos. Okay. No son tan as the first as is tan. And the second uh, one is como. Como. And okay. Como. Yes. And that is the first one. The second one. What is the difference between those two? Mm, it's, it's the same living in, a par in an apartment like a house. Yeah, you are giving you are giving them the same value. You are giving yeah. them the same importance. Yeah. You don't care if you have a house or if you have an apartment. You are you are happy. Yeah. At the end. And that is the difference. But we just add the word just. 
houses are are just as convenient as apartments. Okay, they have the same uh, the same meaning, meaning the yeah. same importance in the sentence. In the importance in the first sentence, which which of the object does it have it? Which is the object that has the importance in the first sentence? It's apparent. Uh, uh, okay, the question is, what is the object that has the importance Important. in the sentence? Yes. Houses, Houses or apartments? What What oh. is better? What's better? Uh, apartment. 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 Oh. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Apartments because you say houses aren't. And that means negative. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Problems with the... Oh, okay. No problem, Joshua. I hope that you can recover the internet thing now. Okay, good. Um, if you check, both sentences can have as, as, and you can use the same or a different adjective. Not only the same one. Okay, let's try. Let's try with uh, examples. Um, let me... Okay. It's the same indication. Make sentences to evaluate with a correct adjectives or nouns according with the pictures. Picture one, what is that? What's in picture one? The river. river. Uh, a river. A lake. Um, no, picture. that's not a lake. Uh, it's a river. Right here are the uh, mistake too. With the second cent. Uh, ah, okay. The thing is that I copy in the, yeah. the same part. <laughs> and the, and so I copy the same mistake. Okay, okay, let's correct it. Good, good. Okay, now it's correct. Teacher, I have a question. Uh -huh. Question. How can I pronounce convenience or convenience? No sé cómo se dice. Okay, we have different uh, words with uh, a similarity. Okay, convenient. Let's repeat. Convenient. 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 Okay, and convenience. We have two. They are different. Convenient is the adjective. Okay. Is it to uh, Latin? And convenience is the? What is convenience? Uh, the? <laughs> the no. no, 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 the word is now. Okay, countable or uncountable? Uncountable. Okay, uncountable. if you want to make sure, uh, remember, you can use the dictionaries to double check. Uh, okay, just quickly, we can check to take the doubt out. Noun, and it says correct, is uncountable. Uncountable. That's right. Okay, good. Okay, let's come back to the uh, lesson in the presentation. Okay, the first one is not a is not a lake. It's a river. 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 And the second one ocean. Is ocean. 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 Okay. Uh, can you make a sentence uh, comparing them with this structure? As using as as. Yes. Rivers. Uh -huh. A river aren't as big as ocean. The river aren't. Uh -huh. Can you continue? As big. As big. As ocean. As the ocean. D. Why yes. do I say D? Why do I say D? What can be on D? Because the next word begins with a vowel. Begins with a vowel, the next word, ocean. And the, it has the, the sound of B. Got it? No, what, okay, no? okay. When, I will repeat. When the word is, when the word, is, uh, uh, when, the word when the next is, word after was, the begins in uh, vowel, because uh, what is a vowel in ocean, the first one? Oh, oh, oh yeah. Better. Oh, that's why the is not pronounced and the is in the. Yes, okay. is uh, the, the the ocean. The ocean. Yes, the. the ocean. And you pronounce the when the next word begins with a consonant. It's the opposite. Okay. The? The, desk. The, desk. the desk. Okay. That's why I say the. the ocean. Oh, okay. Yes. I didn't that, know that rule. Okay, that is a tip, yeah. Mm, yeah. 
we need to study uh, many rules in English to improve our speaking skills. That's that's what we are doing. Okay. Uh, is the sentence correct? The river aren't, aren't as the as the ocean. Okay. Uh, uh -huh. We have the the words yes. as. As. Yeah. As. Okay. Uh, the, someone says the river is. Yeah, it's, it's singular. Rare. We have only yeah, one singular. Yeah. Okay, there is a mistake. It's Isn't as it's big as? The, as the ocean. The ocean. The ocean. Okay, very good. That is correct. Now it's correct. Remember, singular or plural, but no problem. That's a common mistake, but great. Okay, now invert, invert the order. Please say first about the ocean and then about the river. Using the just. Okay, we can use the word just mm -hmm. in the screen. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try. The ocean is just as dangerous. Oh, okay. No sé si ahí está bien. Not as a river. Okay, the ocean is just as dangerous as. Remember, we have the two. River, the, the river. river. The river. Hey, that's true. Both things, both things are dangerous. If you cannot swim, you can you can drown. No matter if it's a river or if you are at the ocean. That's correct. Dangerous as the ocean. Okay. The river. The ocean. Ah, oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I placed it the ocean twice the river okay yeah correct the sentence is is totally correct good 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 okay are you getting it how to compare two things with the different structures remember we are gonna uh, we are checking grammar rules etc but after this what comes is practice practice making sentences and doing exercises online etc Good questions. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, I, when when we want to compare something with other thing, uh, always we use as something as. Uh -huh. Okay. What about if I say, si digo, uh, no soy tan malo como como mi hermano, digamos. <laughs> Uh -huh. No soy tan English, malo como mi hermano. Ok, en inglés, of course. No soy tan malo como English, mi hermano. Like, I am. Uh, I am like my brother. Ok, we use the same, the same structure, no like. We are not saying like. Like is uh, for a different thing. We are comparing two things. Ok. I am I'm not. not. Um, bad. As bad. 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 No, bad. As my As bro. My bro. My bro. My bro. Okay, that's informal. My bro. Brother. Okay, is the sentence correct? Uh -huh. Is yes or like no? the comparative and superlative? No, those are different. Uh, the comparative is, it would be, I am taller than my brother or the com the superlative is i am the tallest in my family but if you check we are not using those comparative these ones are different different ways to compare or to give things a specific a qualification depending on the importance of the things comparatives and superlatives is a different topic all right Yes, it's different. Okay, but you can use them too. No problem, you can use them. But we are studying these structures. But they are they are a way to compare too. No problem. All right. And the sentence is correct. Okay, let's see another one. Evaluating with, with nouns. The previous one. Previously, we had comparisons with adjectives. With the adjectives. For example, the adjective is? Big. 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 Another adjective 
dangerous. 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 Another adjective. Bad. 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 Okay. But now we are going to evaluate with nouns. No. With nouns. Okay. You can use. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Do. 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 Or negative. Or or a few more. In the same case, in as la, as the verb to be, <laughs> we were using verb to be in a few more or in negative, depending, right? Depending. Okay. Uh, let's see the next one. Can you read the sentence, please? Apartments, Apartments don't, have don't have enough, enough parking. parking. Okay. The auxiliary is in. Don't. In negative. 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 Okay. We have the verb, we have the, the adverb, but the noun is the parking. parking. The parking lots. Okay. If you check, evaluating with nouns. This time, do you see any adjective in the sentence? No. Is it dangerous? No. Do you see bad? No, no. No, right? We don't use. in With this structure, we don't use any adjective. Because instead of the adjective, we use the nouns. Okay, on the second sentence, uh, or any uh, other uh, verb, uh, plus two. two. Okay, we have two options. You can use auxiliary with another verb and enough, or you can say it this way. Houses. Houses cost too much, much, money. much money. Money. Okay. Do you see any adjective in on the second sentence? No. Any adjective? Much. Uh, no. no. Much is no. not. What is no. much in this case? What adverb. is much? Adverb. Are you sure that adverb. is an adverb? adverb? Okay. Let's check. Let's check. Much definitions in synonyms. Okay. As first is an adverb. Yes. Adverb. Correct. Okay, good, good, good. Uh, let's see. Houses. That's too much money. Yes. That's too much money. And, and that is true. If you check, no adjectives. We are saying uh, or we are evaluating things with nouns. With nouns. Yes. Okay, let's do a couple of sentences with this one. I can see, okay, maybe is your phone when that happens, or is your internet, or is a phone. Maybe you can reopen the, the application without going out, sin salirse. All right? Um, you can try with that. Is what, it is, sometimes. what is the app? The, the app? Yeah. Ah, it's the, the this Zoom. Oh, okay. I have some, okay. some application. Okay. Okay. Or if not, you can rejoin. You can try with, but sometimes is the internet connection. Okay. Let's see. Let's do some examples, but check. Check how the sentences are with the nouns. Okay. We are checking the parking, parking lot, or a beautiful, a beautiful house that costs too much money. Okay, uh, let's see. The first picture, what is the first picture? Bed. Okay, look at that bed. Can you try to make a sentence uh, using any of the two structures with the, for the object? Using them. In order. Uh -huh. Or you can use the verb to be. Okay, but I can duplicate the two beds, no problem, to make it plural. Now I have two. Okay. Mm -hmm. But you can use auxiliary, remember. Yeah, it's impossible to use the verb to be as the first one, but in this case, we are using uh, don't. The bed don't have. The bed don't have. Don't, don't. Have, okay. The bed don't. The. Don't is. Uh, the bed. The bed. The bed. Mm -hmm. Don't. Do you see don't. any uh, almohad? Uh, big uh -huh. pillow. Have pillow. Ah, okay. Hi. The beds. The bed. 
don't uh, don't eat, uh-huh. don't, 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 don't have, have have pillows any any pillows, any pillows, pillows. on on them okay. on them sobre ellas on them okay do you see any adjective in the sentence no 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 adjective because we are using nouns okay we have the auxiliary in negative in the simple present this is not verb to be we have the verb have and any okay and the noun what is the missing object in the pictures pillow no. okay and pillows and pillows are are what pillows are are nouns. nouns correct nouns. pillows nouns. are nouns. Nouns. nouns yes okay is the sentence correct yes it is correct it is yeah. okay next picture next That's picture right. uh -huh. can you repeat it what is that concerts ah concert. concert okay but imagine that the band is going to uh, organize uh, five concerts in the city I am using plural, five concerts, singular or plural, you decide, but the picture is in singular. 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 Okay, the concert, the concert, that's too much fun. Ah, the same one, <laughs> the same sentence. Um, okay, yeah, it is correct, but try to do or try to make a different sentence with a different uh, noun. Or compliment. Try it. Try it out. The concert is too many people. In the yes, the concert or in the concert are a lot of people. Okay. In the concert. Yeah, the concert are 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 many. Okay. Many are mm, are. ¿Cómo no. digo hay en inglés? ¿Cómo digo hay? No only are. 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 Yeah, are. There are. Are. are many people. There are, there many. are. a lot there of are. people. A lot or many. A lot, a lot. A lot of. Uh, a lot of people. A lot of people. Lot of people. Correct. Let's check. A house costs too much. Okay, we are not using too. In your mm. sentence, but the sentence is uh, correct. Yeah. Uh -huh. I mean, but I said there are too many people. Okay, are too many? Yes, yes. it's possible. In yeah. the course, there are two too many people. Too many people. Correct. Two yeah. many people. Okay. People. In this case, we are using two. And what is the what is the noun that we are using? People. Um, people. people people okay we are referring that the concert is is crowded because of the people in it all right and now you are using this uh, this structure in the same in the same way as this example money is a noun and in your sentence people is the noun that we are referring to Okay, uh, let's see. Let's do something more. Okay, with these two, you decide. You can use this structure. Let me place it. Okay, you can use this structure with the verb to be, using enough, using uh, is to or are to, depending if it's singular or plural, or you can use this structure as for example convenient as but that depends on the on the noun you can use this structure or you can use the third one using the auxiliary eh, affirmative or negative or using it with the word to and using nouns you decide with the next ones okay you can do any any sentence and this one remember just as many rooms as houses or don't have as much okay this is different right we didn't read them apartments apartments have just as many rooms as houses 
uh, that can be can be possible. Uh, this is another structure after your sentences. We have another structure uh, using just as plus another s. Correct. See, just as many rooms as houses or apartments ha don't have as much privacy as houses as houses ok, how do I say, como digo how do I say no. que los buses no tienen eh, tantos asientos como los como los airplanes how do I say that in English the buses the buses Okay. Don't, have, don't have don't have don't as, have as, as, as many as many or much much many, uh, many seats correct many, many seats seats as as, as airplanes or planes you can say planes, planes too planes. or flight right uh, no, flight no, is flight. The, the action. The action. The yes. Ah, yeah, plane. Planes. And planes is the object. Yeah. Okay. okay. Uh, we have the auxiliary in negative because we are saying that buses don't have, don't have as, as many seats. As many seats. Planes. Oh, okay, good. Okay, good. And how do I say, uh, how do I say, que la, quiero ver? Que el agua no tiene tanta sal como una sopa maruchan en inglés. The water, the water don't have, don't have no. much uh, salt. The water doesn't. Correct, doesn't. Why doesn't? Uh-huh. Why doesn't? Why doesn't? It's third person. It's the third person in third the person. simple present tense, simple correct. Present. Yeah. The water doesn't, doesn't have, have, as, as have as much, much salt. salt. It has, okay, it has Men's much salt as Maruchan soup. Because Maruchan soups are extremely salty. I don't, I don't eat them. Okay. <laughs> Great, and the sentence is correct, but be careful. Be careful about the noun. You gotta check if it's uh, plural or if the noun is singular. Another noun, right? And according with the noun, the okay. with the tense, the simple present tense, uh, where to be, doesn't matter. In the structure, as much or as many, that depends on the on the noun. Okay, that okay. depends on the noun. Depende del noun. Money, countable or uncountable? Money. Uncountable. Uncountable, yes. As a, as a group, as a group, yes. But what about if I say a hundred dollars? Is yeah. that, is it still a, fee, uh, is it still a singular yeah. or not? A hundred dollars. A hundred dollars is singular. singular. Uh, no, money is singular in in a hundred dollars is plural. One dollar, two dollars, three because yeah. you can count them. Yeah. Okay, good. Uh, let's see what is uh, what is next uh, about this lesson. Ah, okay, remember you can use any of the structures if you can remember them. But if not, I'm gonna show them to you for you to check them. Just check how the instructors are used. Okay, your sentences. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The next structure is with as convenient as, etc. Your sentences isn't as big as, or the ocean is just as. Okay, the same importance, see? Both are dangerous. Or these ones, Apartments, in negative, etc. Okay, let's try to do. First picture, what is that? Maybe chocolate. I have chocolate. 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 No, it's chocolate. 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 Okay, let's begin. 
singular or plural according with the picture plural. that you see. Plural. Choc chocolate. Chocolates. Chocolates. Chocolates are, are always delicious. Okay, are always are delicious. Always delicious. delicious. Okay, delicious. Okay, good, good. Is the sentence correct? Póngale el tú delicioso. Mm. Yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Podemos yes. usar tú, ¿verdad? Yes, yeah, the, that yes, is the purpose sir. that you use in the structures, yes. Two the lips. Are two, do I delete uh, always? Always. Do I... Yeah, the lips. Always to the lips. Are yes. two. But let's check, you are using two. Let's check. Mm -hmm. uh, are two, okay. Let's see. And yes. according with this? Are too delicious. delicious. But uh, let's check. Let's check something. Are too small for big dogs. There is a compliment in this part. Um, mm -hmm. Can you okay. add a more compliment to the sentence? In every occasion. In, correct. Okay. In every occasion. Yes. So why not? After the dinner, after lunch, you can get a chocolate. Yeah. Okay, good. Uh, the sentence is correct. Okay, uh, but below the chocolates, we have another picture. What is that Strawberry picture? Cotton. No sé cómo se dice. Sweet cotton. Uh, no. Sweet, no. no. Cotton, cotton, cotton candy. Cotton, cotton candy. Cotton, cotton, cotton candy. candy. Okay, in plural, candies. Cotton candies. Candies. Uh -huh. Uh, make the sentence, please, uh, using any uh, structure that cotton we used previously. The, the cotton candies. Cotton candies, okay. Two are two sweets. sweets. Are, but you have already uh, used two sweets. Okay. Ah, yeah. Use another okay. structure. Are in, the cotton, are in, cotton candies are, in, are, in, uh, are, in, uh, are just as... Okay. Are in good for tea. For tea. Um, okay, let's order the sentence. You are close. Sacerca. You are close. But what you need to do is double check the, the structures. So we can see. Okay. No, don't you like that one? You can use this one. I would like to use yours. Um, okay. Just remember the sentence that you have. That the current adding adding as a, convenient as it. No, okay, aren't as, as uh, expensive. Aren't, Why not expensive? Aren't, uh -huh. aren't, yeah, adding healthy for your teeth. As expensive. The sentence is correct, but uh, yeah. the structure is missing yet. Todavía le falta la structure. As expensive as as correct as expensive as as chocolates. All right. Let's let's check the sentence. Cotton candies aren't as expensive as as chocolates. Okay. Is the sentence correct? Yes. So. Yes. 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 yes, 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 it is. It is correct. Yes, it is 100%. Uh -huh. 100 correct. Correct. Teacher, I have a question. Question, yes. Yes, about this. Uh, una pregunta. Este, yo al principio de la clase no me pude conectar y se me desconectaba, se me congelaba la pantalla, no veía nada. Vaya, eh, cuando usa el dos, as, dos veces, as, as, eh, ¿cómo, ¿cómo lo interpreta? Disculpe, ¿cómo lo traduce? Uh, Okay, guys, can you answer to your classmate? Okay, the first ask is like uh, una comparación. Tan, tan. ¿Qué significa tan? Ajá. Tan, y el otro como. es como el... Tan, como. Como, como. como. como um, comparativo. Tan, tan caro como, como para chocolate. comparar. Ajá. Que Con diferentes. Ah, okay. okay. Sí, gracias. Es que no, no tenía muy claro eso. Muchas gracias. Okay, but now, guys, read it, read the, the meaning, no problem. Read the meaning. Los dulces. Dulces de algodón no son tan caros como los chocolates. And that is true, that is true. Okay, that's true. Okay, good, the sentence is correct. And that is the meaning. The primer as, the first as, one is tan, 
tan caros, caros como chocolate. Okay, good. Um, okay, can you make a third sentence using the same two pictures but with another structure? Can you use another one? Um. <clears throat> with as a noun, for example. No as a noun, with adjectives, no with adjectives. For example, with nouns, evaluating things with nouns. What can you say about chocolates? The chocolates? Mm -hmm. uh, the cualquier yeah. point. Yeah. Can these aren't healthy for us? Cotton. Cotton candy. Uh -huh. Cotton candy aren't healthy? Okay, healthy is an adjective. No adjective, remember. No adjective. Uh -huh, no adjective, yes. The no adjective <laughs> is this, this structure, see? With nouns. You can use auxiliary don't or this uh, structure too. <laughs> Okay, ¿por qué no decimos que los chocolates no tienen proteínas? In English, how do I say that? Just example. Chocolate. Chocolate. Chocolate don't have, 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 have protein. Okay. Chocolates. Chocolates. I don't have. I don't have. Don't have proteins. Proteins. Why aren't? Why aren't? Yes, why aren't? Don't. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Oh, but you said, and the aquí la sentence dice, uh -huh. los chocolates no son, tienen proteínas. Uh, no don't sense. Have. Doesn't, doesn't, doesn't. Don't have. Don't. Doesn't or don't. That doesn't have don't. protein. No, uh, don't. The uh -huh. chocolate, chocolate haven't protein. Don't have. Okay. The letter S means that is plural, plural. plural because Aven. of the letter S. But yeah. no S with, with this noun is single. Yeah. But I say chocolates. How many in the picture? The chocolate is singular or plural? Plural. 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 One, plural. Two, three, four, five. We have many, many chocolates. Yeah. So we can, yeah. we need to say chocolates. Don't, huh? don't, 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 don't have, have. Mm -hmm. don't have, don't have proteins. Don't have proteins. Okay, and the sentence is correct because instead of adjective, you are using nouns. Okay, you are using nouns instead of adjectives. Okay, good. Uh, let's see. We got something else pending. We have these uh, practice time. Let's practice the comparative forms with adjectives and nouns. Okay, let's see what the game is about. We have some, a few minutes to practice this. Okay, I'm gonna pause the music. Okay, choose the correct answer. Elephant, 5,500 kilograms and the hippo is 1,500 kilograms. The elephant isn't as heavy as the hippo. The hippo. Can you, you can read it, guys. Not only me, <laughs> practically. The first. The hippo isn't. The elephant isn't as the elephant. Number three. Number three. Which one, which one? Number three. Uh, number yeah. three. Number three. Two. Okay, let's see number three. Yes. yes, correct. Okay. Yes. Good, good. Let's see the uh -huh. next sentence. Yeah. iPhone, iPhone 1000 uh -huh. euros and Samsung 600 euros. But read the sentence, not only the first one, the second one, the third one. Read the sentence. Uh, the second is false. Uh, number three. Number three. The iPhone yes. is as expensive no, as the no, Samsung. Number one. No, right? Number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. The iPhone number is one. not as cheap. The iPhone is not as cheap. Okay. Okay. 
Nice, yeah. correct. Nice. <laughs> okay. You gotta read the question and scan according with the exercise. Order the following sentence and choose the correct answer. Okay. Hat. Is, uh, isn't expensive, hat is expensive as the, the, the charro the charro hat no <laughs> the Mexican hat, hat hat Mexican. is expensive hat. with the Mexican hat no. okay uh -huh. um, with the Mexican hat the fur no and the last one Mexican the last one. Okay, the last one. Okay, Number four. Yes. Number four. True or false? True. True. False. False. True. Yeah, but but try not to use too many too much Spanish. Too many. Oh, too many no, it's too much. I try not to use too too much Spanish. False, false. False. It was true. We use you as adjective Okay, what about that? True, I think it is true. True. Okay. It was true. Correct. It was true. Okay, and let's see if we have another one. Six. Okay, then it says, the boy is as brave as. Okay, it is comparing two things in the same level. The boy in the light. In the same level. But according with the picture, are they, are they in the same level? They are in the picture, they are not in the same level. In the sentence, yes. Next. I don't know, maybe. According with the picture, evaluate the picture. It's canon. It looks like George wants to eat and they all want to eat George. It's true. It's true. Yeah. All right, it's true. All right, all right. Let's see in the next one. The next one is it is the correct structure. Okay. Yes. Okay. With this, with this type of sentences, when you see these. Uh, this rule is kind of complicated. It's better to do it with examples. But in your opinion, it's true. 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 Correct. It's true. Okay. Let me check the time, guys. I don't want to take you. Take you. One. One. Okay. The structure for comparisons of quantity goes like this: subject plus verb to be. Remember, plus verb to be. As Plus many or much, depending on the noun, as plus complement. True. True. Okay. Yes. Correct. Okay. You got the. You got the lesson. Perfect. The man. True. True. It's true. Correct. It's true. Oh, we got a <laughs> Okay, we, we gave it for granted. Lo vimos por sentado, que ya la sabíamos, but no. Okay. Good, good. 
Is it time, guys? Let me. I don't have the option to. Or second. Oh, okay. It's almost eight o'clock. Okay, guys, and the lesson is already uploaded in the Google Drive, so you can have this exercise, practice again, read the rules that we were studying tonight, and and more. See the hey, don't forget the platform to do the assignments. Do the assignments in the platform. Don't leave it at the at the last moment. Okay. Oh, please um, remember, teacher, send me the uh, the link for the classes. Ah, uh, okay, but the link is in the presentation already at the, the end. Yeah, ah, but because you mean that you were in, in the chat in WhatsApp yeah. chat. Ah, okay. Yeah, I, I, I will resend it. Okay. No problem. Thank you. I will resend it. Okay, guys, uh, thank you very much for joining to the class. Um, have a nice night that you can be, or you can have, sorry, you can have a nice night. And mm -hmm. see you tomorrow on Wednesday for more topics to cover. I okay, see you. Okay. See you tomorrow. Thank you. Bye see bye. you tomorrow. Bye bye, guys. Take care. Good night. Thank you. Good night, too. Thank you so much.